Hello everybody. Um, nice to see you back after the break. So today's topic, I'll be the facilitator. So I'll be touching on a new space to market your business. Can be your business as in a personal business. It can be business like me as in I have a company, I deal with business. Or it can be other ways like people doing online business. It can be a whole range of it. So uh, we'll touch on slowly. So uh, let me introduction uh, introduce myself first. I'm Mr. Dion, and then uh, Concept Solution is basically my company. Why I take Don Dion and Concept together, Concept to, uh, Solution together? Because we have a relationship for ten years. So for these ten years itself, when I started off, graduate from NGO, I start off with an engineer. Nine months only, I come up to become a boss myself and build a business myself. So and then on, I really uh, start off with Facebook marketing. But that time, it wasn't uh, really smooth. So I go the hard way, uh, not really the right one. I make mistakes, I fall, and I and I topple. But uh, as time goes by, two years ago, uh, I started off picking up, and I, I actually doing it much better off. So I can let you know that uh, what I did for my company. So let me get you to my Facebook page. Okay. So this is my Facebook page. I try to design everything myself. So this is my marketing strategy. I'm not going for leaflet. I'm not going for door to door sales. I'm not going for uh, really like email uh, mass uh, distributing. So I rather go Facebook marketing. All right. So just a short little browse. I'll see you what has happened to me in the past. I'm very quiet. I don't really do. Okay. You see, I started doing some videos for myself, taking photos. Uh, putting a profile for myself. So, Dion, concept and Dion. In fact, I make the video basically. So, just take a while. I hope there's a sound for this one. Just uh, maybe six, 30 seconds of it. Just have to watch. Get back to the our slides. Okay, back right over here. So that's why uh, concept solu solution basically my company and me has been a 10 years relation. That's why I'm actually putting this as a focus for today. All right, let's go. Okay. So uh, in fact, I want to start off with uh, activity. Knowing you, knowing me. In fact, uh, everybody has to go around to understand each other. But the fact is that we have been together for weeks already. So I thought I will really go for this and spend 15 minutes. Rather, put more time on learning. Alright, so I'll cancel all this. And then, now I'll draw something. And you try to imagine what am I drawing. Okay, so this is a line. Red color line. This is a blue color line. In fact, this one is like my life cycle. So, I will just write down for you guys. So, the red color, in fact, I would say is my health. Or the other words, I would say quality. Later on, you will see what's relating to the Facebook marketing. Alright? Then this one, I would say is the effort. Can everybody see? Okay. So, now, I'm going to do something. A green color pen. I'm going to draw. What am I doing now? Green. I'm drawing a line, right? 
are drawing a line. So it's a drawing of a line, just like the lady that says, making a change. So if I flip it over, so the red color lines will be here. And the blue color line will be down. Okay, so in fact over here I don't say help uh, because help doesn't relate to my Facebook marketing. Okay, I say quality. And then right over here, blue color one, I say effort. Okay, now we see the next slide. This one. Anybody understand about this picture? It's <laughs> <laughs> far, really. <laughs> you see that this is the weight over here is much bigger, the weight over here is short, much uh, lighter, but, but it can actually balance itself. It's a meaning of leveraging. So, we are actually using Facebook to leverage. We use smaller effort, in fact, we get quality leads, we get quality results. That's what I want to implement over here. So, this picture itself, I hope that you all understand about leveraging. Okay, is that great? So, I'll just carry on. Okay, now let me uh, ask questions first. Uh, Any one of you guys really uh, got into Facebook marketing? Anyone? Paris? Yeah. Hong Beng? Yeah. How about a Facebook page? Everyone? Uh, sorry, Facebook profile. Your personal profile. Does everyone have it? Yeah. Yes. If you don't, you don't have, please raise your hand. Yeah. Okay, very good. Okay, so everybody has a certain kind of uh, uh, foundation to it. So Paris, since you already have a Facebook marketing page before, and uh, maybe you can share some of your learning from that, as in uh, how you feel about Facebook marketing and how it works for you. Uh, I think, like what you said, works on leveraging. Like, like traditionally, you would put in a lot of effort, physical effort in marketing, whereas to Facebook, you can actually target specific people, or specific interest groups that you want to like, uh, reach out to. Very good, very good, very nice point. Yes, uh, it does teach uh, that kind of leverage. How about uh, maybe uh, then? I think you're an IT expert over here. Mm -hmm. uh, do you really use uh, Facebook? No, I don't really like Facebook. Because now, it, it, it's in fact, I want to close my Facebook. <laughs> oh, <laughs> after this course, you're going to really think twice before later, that. Later, you know, um, it's not the, the security issue. Uh -huh. The more you put in Facebook, the more people will know your information. Oh. Said, some people tend to not to disclose so much. Mm -hmm. But of course, you talk about marketing will be different. Because I'm not doing uh, my own business. But for me, just to relate to friends, that's all. Alright, alright. So yours is towards uh, social, 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 life, social, social life, life, right? So maybe I ask uh, one last question. Maybe uh, Thomas, I ask you are the, one of the younger lawyers. Oh, yeah? And maybe you can share your experience about how, how you actually think about Facebook marketing. Does it come to your daily life or anything? Mm, I think it's a dying trend for the younger ones. Not me. Uh -huh. but from my personal interactions with the younger kids, they don't use Facebook anymore. Yeah, because to them, it, 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 it's not really the in thing. But I use it for news and stuff like on the feed, and stuff. sometimes people share and see and all that. So, so what do the young ones use? Instagram. 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 Yeah. Yeah, really there's quite a lot of social media, mm. but actually uh, Instagram is basically one of so-called the child of yeah, Facebook. Yeah. But anyway, Facebook is still the bigger parent of it. So why we go for Facebook? Because there's a lot of tools for you to do marketing. Alright, so let's uh, touch on uh, what is the learning outcome since we really know that uh, most people has a Facebook background. Uh, so let's look at the learning outcome. So before we actually start off with Facebook marketing or the so-called simplified digital marketing, we have to set up a Facebook account first. And of course, a Facebook account will actually lead to Facebook page. Okay, so this whole course itself will have two learning outcomes. One is to set up a Facebook account, Facebook page. The other one is to use Facebook mark, uh, Facebook market business. That's the really the end uh, objective or end outcome that we wish for. Okay. So for setting up a Facebook uh, page, well, I will make a, I will make so far uh, this understanding about the Facebook page against a personal uh, profile, and the other one the type of Facebook pages available so that it can actually fit for your business. All right. Then the second outcome will be use Facebook to market your business. There will be types of Facebook uh, ads available, importance of target audience. How to create and publish your ads. 
That's what I want to teach you really hands on. And then marketing this and case study to make your, your this advertisement as quick as possible. Okay. So uh, Facebook marketing, just now I actually jump steps ahead. So I ask you about what what do you think about Facebook marketing? So current moment we already understand what is Facebook marketing, uh, what is Facebook and what we want to expect from that. Okay, this is a question. Which is better place to host a weekly Facebook live video series? Your business page? For one instance, let's say your business page is 200 likes, but your personal profile is 800 friends. Yeah, so you see the difference in numbers, but any answer to this one? Personally, you think about it, uh, maybe you have a 30 seconds, think about it, I'll ask some questions from you. Question, the video, the live video is personal or business? It's for, uh, it's for exposure. It can be business, it can be own, uh, your, your own awareness, or you want to promote yourself with public features. Uh, it's just a live video, basically. Both. So you can treat it as a video anyway. You ask me, I uh, say both. It's kind of you say that's a five dollar note and ten dollar note on the board. Which one you pick? I'll pick both. <laughs> well, you know, uh, as in a wish, you mix it, and then uh, what actually comes <laughs> for you better. <laughs> Uh, I think the business page is actually, even though it has less a like, but mm -hmm. then you uh, can do more with it, more variables you can play around with, compared to just yeah, the friends. You may not even be active also. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's uh, review the answer. Okay. In fact, 90% of the pieces, page will actually outstand uh, our profile page. Why I say 90% not 100%? That's the reason behind. That's why, just like one thing, you have mentioned that it may be both. Yes, it may be both, but maybe 10% of it, uh, you use your profile page, personal profile page, actually market itself. Why, why is the 90%? 90% is 90% of the scenario, page is actually does better than using personal profile. Okay, page is better than using personal profile. Page is what? What is page? Page is what you're talking about. Now we talk about business and personal, so you're talking about 90% is the business page. Mm, page is better than more personal, is it? More for personal. For personal. Purpose. Oh, okay. Yeah. For personal. Okay. So we, that's why I see. I back to back to here. Right over here. I say Facebook page versus Facebook personal profile. Mm -hmm. So we are actually waiting ah. for that one. Mm -hmm. Okay. So right over here, ninety percent of this is on uh, by research uh, and why. That's why I need to touch on the first knowledge. I say Facebook page versus personal profile. Okay, there's a quite a few advantages of Facebook pages. Okay, pages can actually help you to boost posts. You can actually use their marketing tools to make different kind of stuff. You can actually do branding, you can actually do uh, basic marketing or even awareness. Alright, and there's also some intelligence behind that. Uh. In fact, Facebook is implementing a lot of things within, so you can use it for any digital purpose. There will be some uh, measures you can actually tap on later on so that you can improve your advertisement. Alright. Uh, there's also less privacy constraint. Basically, whatever you post is supposed to be public. So that's why you can actually reach out to a bigger crowd of people. Uh, but your personal profile, you only stuck within maybe your circle of friends. And they constrain themselves, they don't share. Basically, you can't actually get the exposure. Right? So, money driven performance. Yeah. Facebook, what they want. They want result. Facebook, definitely, you pay them, they do for you. Okay? And uh, there's no plan in it. Anybody can guess, as in uh, our Facebook personal page, how many friends you can add? Anyone? 5,000. 1,000. 1, no, more than that. More than that. Anyone? No, that's. Anyone? Okay, uh, not to spend too much time. Alright, Facebook personal profile, you can actually add up to 5,000 5, uh, uh, friends. That's why uh, some of the bigger shots, celebrity, 5,000 on the on, they will actually change it to a page. Page gives you unlimited fans. So you can have a lot of people. Anybody? So uh, maybe? between a page and normal Facebook? Uh, you, uh, personal Facebook account, basically, uh, it's your own personal thing. Uh, it has privacy uh, protection. You can only post your photo, mm -hmm. maybe with your relative, with your friend, with your kids. Uh, only for that purpose, you will not want to actually to share your privacy to the outside world, which is public. Yeah, that's why you need to set up a page. 
And page itself, there's a few kinds of page, and that will actually be the next knowledge that we can touch on, maybe on the next uh, session. Okay. So uh, that's an activity I wish you all to help. All right. So I will pass on uh, five pages. Uh, I will form you guys into two uh, two people in a group. So let's say we just go from the left all the way. So Paris and uh, with Natasha. You guys uh, be one group, and then David and Kunwa uh, and Belinda and Jenny. And I think if I need your help, yeah, would you mind you can uh, share with Jenny? Okay. Yeah, but hold on first, wait for my instruction. Okay, now this is your A3 size paper. Okay, you all help me to actually to write a benefit up here. Then you write your name over here, name one, and then name two. Then you can start listing, start listing the benefit that you think about this page is having. Previously, I already said some of the benefits. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, the benefits. You yeah. write your name here, yeah, just like uh, Danny and then uh, Berlin. Yeah, I'll be just right here. If you got any question, you can just ask me, I'll come by. You can use different kinds of uh, other markers to make it uh, more lively. So it just take about five minutes. So now it's about, uh, we just take the clock over here. So at four o'clock, uh, let's be do something. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Yeah, about last 30 seconds, more or less. Yeah. 
If everybody is ready, you can just raise up and then uh, we can just uh, try to go ahead. John, you're the one in the first seat. Okay, John? Everybody okay? So, the one has a schedule. I will do a simple sort and uh, you guys can sit down, relax, but uh, if you all want to stand up uh, to flex your arm muscle, it's fine. So perhaps I shall wait here, you all can review a bit, if you all need to add something. <laughs> Just one minute. Just have a view of it. I would appreciate that you all can help look at the details and then if you want to uh, possible help your friend. Help your friend for instance. Uh, Hi guys, over here. Okay, now uh, Rita and uh, Jenny, uh, sorry, uh, Rita and Audrey. Audrey has, uh, has this uh, done by uh, Jenny and then uh, Hong Ping. So we do this sheet over here and later on this help to maybe uh, do a feedback on uh, on this. Yeah, later on, uh, you all can help eventually to uh, express uh, what is the benefit uh, by your friend has stated. Okay, we just take it uh, another thirty seconds and hope that you all can help to present. Oh. Yeah, you can add on or you can actually just later on you understand the point that yeah. yeah, you can help to present. Yeah. So oh, if you are presenting on behalf of oh, the yeah. Yeah. So you guys will be presenting on behalf. Okay. So, okay. So all done. You try to ensure that you try to explain whatever you can that you are Business focus. So the pain itself is basically for business marketing. Why? That's why we call business focus. Not for purpose of innovating sales or. Um, Alright, okay. All right, okay. I think uh, probably we have to round this out. Okay, so you guys, maybe you can start off with uh, Natusha and uh, Maurice. Perhaps uh, one of you can help to maybe help your friend. Okay, um, so from Danny and Belinda, what they said is uh, it helps to reach out to more people. Uh, we pay for promotion, it's free to use. Uh, I mean, if you don't go to pay for everything, uh, you can save money. Less effort. You get a worldwide audience, uh, there are a lot of tons of marketing tools you can use, and you're not restricted by privacy setting. You are not restricted. Not restricted by privacy, okay. Alright, uh, David and Hope. Okay. So what? This one is from the Sunday yeah. Stories. Yeah. Um, unlimited likes and, follow and followers. And uh, there's uh, an extra data. They actually post uh, every two days, my email. With marketing tools that can be used to target uh, market, and then they shove it, uh, and you can post out to around the world, even to outer space. What was that again? To so outer space. Yeah, okay. even to outer space. Finding <laughs> 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 business. Probably how it goes around to the outer. So, uh, so Jen, uh, then perhaps you can help. Okay. Uh, this one from David and Juma. Facebook, Facebook page got a message that actually they are unlimited, have unlimited number of friends. They are very similar. And then uh, it's better for marketing. Then privacy or profile. This one I don't understand, but I, I guess maybe not restricted by privacy, so mm. not the same as the personal profile. So okay. everybody can add privacy. Good. And then it's good marketing tools. Alright, thanks. Okay, and Jen, one of you, please. So uh, this is from Lisa and Audrey. So they say that it includes ex increased exposure, then choose target audience. Uh, we can reach out to the new uh, market, and then increase of people outreach, and then uh, comments of your point of view, um, unlimited posting, affordable business too, less regulated influencers, easily controlled. And then statistic tracking uh, measurable, 
Okay, and different people in can access, in the com company can access. And then right, lastly, so must be, right? yeah, lastly is share videos and photos. Share videos and photos, okay, alright. Alright, um, Peter and uh, Audrey? No, <laughs> 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 Okay, uh, this is from uh, Frank and Jenny. Uh, they got a lot of points, but we'll be summarizing for them. Uh, okay, so um, share latest trends and news via live update and status update. So all these are the knowledge sharing, this motivation sharing, connection with uh, people like friends and relatives and uh, like-minded community. Educate the target audience on your company's products and services. Uh, and if they are interested, you have any events, you can sign up for that. I want to add on one, they put down their sign up events, but uh, they can also put in, uh, they can create an online event to get sign ups. Yes, yeah. both will happen, yeah. yeah, like this. Yeah. Okay, so um, the purpose of this activity is to try to get you uh, into the picture of understanding the benefits of a Facebook page. Okay, so Facebook page versus uh, Facebook personal account. This is the, uh, the key learning point. All right, so now we want to touch on again, emphasize again, what is the advantage of having a Facebook page and why we need to start off setting up a Facebook page in order to do Facebook marketing. All right, so just now we mentioned already, many people have actually had similar thoughts, saying that we can actually post post by using marketing tools. Then there will be some intelligence behind, we can actually do some data tracking, uh, get some data, get some statistics, and then that's privacy, so we can have an outreach for more people, blah blah blah, all these are similar stuff. Okay, but these are two things that uh, some of you have actually mentioned. Okay, are you fine? Okay. Just yeah, the question. Uh, yeah. Actually, when we set up the uh, face for, for the school for the business, do we need to pay? Is it free money? Uh, you set up a Facebook page, it's actually free. But if you want to really generate it and help you, then you have to pay. Yeah, but it depends. You can actually uh, get your friends actually like your page. Just like some people actually mentioned about get your friends, your relative like your page, and then uh, it turns out to be your followers. Then you can actually showcase whatever you have done before. Okay, if that's time permitted, then I will show uh, my Facebook profile and then uh, how I actually use my Facebook page in order to generate some sales. Okay, so the other one is lead generation. This is a very important thing you want to do online. Uh, like this one set up events, you really need to have a lead generation. Then you can actually set up appointment seminar, fill up your, your rooms. These are great stuff. Huh? Or you can actually do a market research just right over there. Yeah. Getting uh, asking people to survey takes a long time. Facebook, a few clicks, maybe half an hour is that a company you can get a well, uh, verified response. Okay, so in all in all, everything itself, the most important thing. All the tools that Facebook actually generate, in fact, is all in favor of page. That's why 90% is more better to actually have page in order to do digital marketing. So to round up this thing, uh, back to the learning key learning point, which is the grant. Okay, I hope that you guys actually see that in order to set up uh, to get the lead. Uh, my main point, to use Facebook to market your business, you have to get to understand about I start off with this gentleman over here. Anybody who don't know this person? You know him. Yeah. He's our yeah. idol. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so he mentioned about we don't pray for his life. We must pray that he can endure a difficult one. This yeah. one is the spirit that we wish for. We want to change. We want to make life different. We want to use certain tools to make our life better by having response, having results. Okay, so the next photo is also a gentleman. <laughs> you. Yeah, better be you. Okay. Wow. <laughs> 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 I will pose, but uh, of course uh, I will be shy if I'm standing over here. So anyway, this one I was taken about two years ago, but this is not my point, uh, this story. I was actually 76 at the time. Yeah, I was at the moment. I must say, I'm actually uh, not under my prime. Okay. Anyway, I do it because I got a wedding shoot. I want to make it nice for myself. I want to be responsible. I want to look nice. That's my own personal achievement. Mm. Yeah. But anyway, 
this is to tell you that uh, we need to have certain uh, drive, uh, motivation, or self determination in order to get the spirit to do something else. So, why I show this? Okay, because it relates to something over here. <laughs> Even you want to use Facebook, you want to make a change, you must adapt to it, you must be uh, determined to make a difference. Yeah. And other than having the spirit, you must be smart. That's why here comes this picture. Uh, that time, that time we actually, I actually draw it on the whiteboard. But in fact, I didn't make too much explanation. In fact, effort comes over, over here, but result goes high. So, this tells us that by using Facebook, we can actually use little effort, but we can actually gain high result. Result as in leads, can be response, can be awareness, can be sales. Yes. That one is uh, the most uh, important for business. Yes. So, it relates to this one again. This one is another picture. Mm -hmm. So, you see, there's a mighty mouse over here, then there's a big elephant over here. So, by using the right tools, it makes us stronger. So, let us all be a mighty mouse. So, everybody here about the, how good Facebook can be? Mighty mouse. Okay, show us. Alright, so uh, the learning outcomes. So I'll make it quick. So uh, in order to use Facebook to market your business, definitely you must set up a page. And why a page later on I'll touch on again. Okay, and definitely the final part, we must use Facebook to really market our business. That's the goal of uh, this lesson. Okay, back to this one. I think last time, the last lesson, in fact a lot of people having a lot of questions as in what is the 90%. Now I put on a sentence. In fact, 90% what I meant is that a Facebook page actually works better for business 90% most of the time. So, this is the 90% that I, I got to convey. So, everybody would as in, understand about the point for 90% now? It works better for business most of the time. Yes. Why 90%? Yeah, because there's also a certain proportion that uh, it can actually work out in somewhere else. I will show you later on. It may okay. go against the business? It Sorry. can go against can the business. go against the business, but of course you must really uh, cultivate well, uh, so that because it's your reputation, it's your brand, you must do something that actually catches other people's attention. So you will show us how to do that now, to be uh, in the ninety percent. But, but but this time, uh, we will actually touch on one uh, learning outcome because that time we only touch on the key learning points. Okay, yeah, let's so go. This time we actually okay, try to do something. Go. Yeah, so get your laptops ready later on to do something. Okay, finding it now. Sit back first. Uh, that time, I think there are questions people don't understand what is called a page. That's why there's a lot of complication. Now, I will show you what is called a page. Give me a moment to let me go to the website. Okay, so this is my personal profile. You can see that it's not really like a page because it comes with a personal stuff and post. Even my wife is there. I don't really want to do that, isn't it, for my personal profile? Okay, so this is also not my prime. In fact, this one I'm 74 kg. By my prime, I, I wish for it 72, but that was a long time ago. I, I, I wish for I will still try for it, not now. Um, you know? Why is okay. not your preference to have your wife there? And yet you oh, have no, this one is a page. That's why uh, this is not a very good this point. A page is for business. This one and is a personal, personal profile. profile. So, what do you think? Uh, for instance, do you have a Facebook page yourself? A Facebook profile yourself? Yes. Okay, so you actually post maybe with your child, maybe yeah. with your hubby, right? So these are all your personal life. Alright, this is not a page. Okay? So now, I'll show you. Okay. So now, just drop it. You are just a line. Between a Facebook profile and a Facebook page. Now, this is a profile. Later on, you see. Profile is a personal one. Yes, profile is a personal one. Say personal and say business one. Is it? Yeah, personal. So now, page is for most of the case is for business purpose. So you can see that over here, in fact, I got quite a few pages over here. Okay, but over here, basically, I just created one. Yeah, in fact, you can just create and then delete off. So today, you all just take your time. Create something for yourself, not necessarily must be perfect. Okay, you can go back, you can delete off, and then you can do it again. So, you can see over here, I got a page for this uh, Renault Training uh, Academy, uh, Academy, sorry, and then even got business to promote. 
Uh, I even got this uh, wish travel, wish happy travel. I worked for some travel business, and then I got my own basketball team. Yeah. Okay. And then uh, my father used to doctor. I got a doctor pitch as well. Yeah. So concept solution is basically the one that I'm actually focusing for this uh, few years. Okay. So you can have fun for fun and many pitches. Yes, 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 yes. So I would say it's unlimited. Uh, I, I, I thought you were open 100. Yes, that's right. That's right. So we need to the diversity. Uh, 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 You can see from my, my side, in fact, I got even for FMB, I got basketball, I got even for my own business. So, uh, let's go into and then you will see that what is called pitch. What's the dangers always associated with the email? email? Yes, yes, it depends on whether you are having a business or not. Yeah, later on, there will be a lead. Uh, the handout is actually shows you what is required in order to open the page. Okay, so now I just let you know, guys, uh, just to look at it. So a page itself normally is like this. It's like advertisements. You are just writing whatever good, whatever uh, fantastic it is. You see, I post myself. Uh, and then we'll be having reviews. I, I wish to get people to write reviews. Of course, uh, I have a thick skin. Uh, I also write some <laughs> review for myself. Uh, okay, so you post your projects. You post video, what you have done. You can book meetings to catch attention. Uh, this is called a page, and yesterday I was doing this. Okay, so on and on, you can actually post, and you can see from here. I think this one you see, there's also a boost post. Your personal profile doesn't need to that. Okay, mm -hmm. so this is called a page. One more, one more page, then we will head on further. Uh, then we will try to actually to create a create a page for itself. Okay, so I come over here. Let's see the basketball one. It's body type. Okay, so you create your own awareness. Uh, this, this is a non-profit uh, uh, page. Basically, just to create, get, a con uh, get into a community, get people to come in. Uh, so you can post your stuff over here. It can be your purpose of uh, just getting attention. Not necessarily must be uh, profit making. Okay, so pages are like this. So back to the. How is it different from web page? Sorry. How is it different from web page? Web page. Mm. Web page itself, uh, you can say that's official. I also have an official uh, web page for Concept Solution. Yeah. But the thing is that uh, it's harder to actually to uh, help you promote the business and it takes much more effort that you maybe you have to pay more. But Facebook is really that and you know that the fan club is so big. Yeah, so don't mm. waste it, use the right tool. What's the difference with just post and boost page? Post means that uh, you can post it maybe to your friends. Yeah. I, I, I'll show you over here to see. So I'll go back to my. Okay. Seems like uh, you guys are getting interested. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you have to spend me some time. I, I need you guys to actually create uh, Facebook page yourself. Okay. okay. Uh, right over here. You can see over here. This one is being shared, it was being tagged. You can see over here, Singapore Police uh, Force and then Donzep and then I especially tag my name. Okay, so, okay. so this one uh, is under public. Public, you can see. So this is my wife who actually posted. Yeah, you see, you can see over here the privacy over here. Yeah, it only shares among friends, so it's not reaching out. So for me, myself, I like it as parent. Whatever I post, I like it. Do it as part of it. Yeah, it depends on uh, it depends on one individual. That will be set in zero to you. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. So uh, I think we have to pace on a bit. Yeah. I really wish you all to do something radical. Okay. So the ten percent. Uh, I'll make it quick. You can see that uh, my Facebook page, my Facebook personal profile. In fact, I am actually doing everything for myself. So this is the ten percent. I use my own profile to do business promotion. Okay, so this is the ten percent. Okay, we can look at the handout. I really pass it to you. Okay, that will be the benefits of the Facebook page. 
can check it out. So a checklist that you all got this. Yeah, all this you can actually read up during your free time. So this is one. So there's another checklist that tells you about type of Facebook page. Okay, the type of Facebook page. I put it in category. Okay. So there are different types. So all this you can go back and type here. Okay. Okay. All right. And then uh, there will be just now. Uh, if you want to ask me about uh, emails or any content <coughs> for the Facebook page, in fact, over here will tell you uh, what are the things required for certain categories of Facebook page. Okay. So, can you see? what what we require or what uh, Facebook page when you, um, can let us do? Uh, the Facebook page will actually give you the option to key in all these things. Okay. So, it's up to you whether you want to key in or not. You can actually leave it blank also sometimes. Or give some uh, very very general information. Mm. Yeah. So but if you are, if... I will think local business as mm. uh, as one thing. Of local business, you must find your place. That's why it actually gives you a map option, right? And then people must reach out to you. So you must have an email, must have a phone. But you see, for other things, you are just selling books. I don't think you don't need an email, maybe they just communicate through okay, messages. Can you show us in a private local business, how do we monitor, how do we know what is a check-in, what's the routine we do? Uh, all this, all this later on, uh, check-ins means that you are actually listed in your in, oh. in the map. Do you remember like you go to the airport, yeah. I check into the airport, uh, Changi Airport, these are check-ins. Yeah, these are for business, they teach you more at the country. So, so you are not your active saying it, some of these are optional and some are mandatory. Yes, yes, yes. Even even my myself when I started off, I will not give up everything. I mean, may have a, I may be missing out with address, I may be missing out with maps, but on and on, when you get used to it, you put in more. Okay. None of it is mandatory. Address, for instance, is mandatory. Later on, when you create, you will find that they will actually ask you, if you don't key in anything, you will not proceed. It will not proceed. Okay. But you can type in anything first and then later on. Okay. Yeah. We go to the demo and then you can actually have a view of it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. To the fake address. Okay. So you guys uh yourself uh try to log into your account. Okay. Facebook, yeah, the personal one, personal one. And then from there, you can actually uh, uh, create a Facebook page from there. So, you just button, make a press, it press the uh, text. You don't want to just uh, let, let, let them uh, take that first. Uh, uh, then just keep going. Okay, so I think the uh, whole thing is too much. Uh, Sorry, I, I have created myself a lot. <laughs> I know how to do. Okay. Alright, so okay. so you'll be you you'll be the help to uh, people who know, people who don't know. Uh then yeah, I think uh, we can actually uh, do it more efficiently. Uh, okay, we can just try to pair up each other. Yeah, uh, so if I have yeah, we can help each other. Okay, mine just so, more or less I think everybody is inside. I'm in okay, Facebook now, so what okay. do we do now? Alright, so you can see over here, there's a create on top of this uh, taskbar. On top, there's a create. Yeah. You can press create. Press create. Yeah. It's create. When you press it, it will be the same as mine. Okay. Create page. Okay, when you're in, you ask for option, so you press for page. Pitch, okay? Create pitch. Okay, so I found that there's some uh, differences between the Mac or, or the our our this uh, Microsoft one. So if you cannot find a grid over here, there's a triangular over here. Drop down. Yeah, drop down. When you press the drop down, it comes with a. You can actually create page over here. For my instance, I can actually come over here and create page. Yeah. For people who have not created a page, you actually display create page straight away. 
Everybody still so, okay. so far still holding on to the same thing? Okay, so now we are at page where we say okay. great so business or brand. In, you press the uh, rate of page. If it actually comes from here, you just yeah, say choose. Just choose. Uh, just choose the left side. Business. Just choose the business. I think this is the most uh, awesome. most common one. Okay. Where, you get started. Yes, you get started. You choose this category. Page name. Yeah. So this one you just. Uh, <laughs> Okay. So you can just go over here, we can select either one, but we choose this one, business, because this one is the most common. People are actually opening pages for purpose of doing business. So we get started, go in, then you can find your name, what kind of name you wish for, just type in, and then the category you can just choose it. So uh, this uh, category, can I add my own category or yes, yes, you can I can add uh, category, but for the moment it's only for you to actually to get familiarized. So once back, you can actually change it, you can delete off and then make another new uh, page that you wish for. Hmm. Okay. So uh, it's really uploaded now, it's really step two. Hmm. Okay, so we got a profile page and now it's a cover page. Hmm. Okay, so now... Uh, <laughs> Cover page is the bigger one, the background. But, Actually, but it goes back to local business, no? Uh, you Category. Can, yeah, it goes some of it. Uh, they will actually do their smart selection. Sometimes a uh, local business. Uh, you yeah, do really want to create a business. Local business is the best so far. Otherwise, you can put it on for uh, companies. Yeah. Then companies will come up with like saloon. Uh, maybe a car wash. Uh, so, I, I, so I cannot, uh, the category I cannot choose my own, I have to put local business. Uh, you can click on the general first one. Okay, la. Uh, yeah, then, then later on, on, then you can find out because there's a lot of selection over there. Okay. Sometimes it's the keywords. So the postal code must be, must be an actual postal code? For a current moment, no need. No need, yeah, huh? Phone moment, number uh, optional, don't show my address, only show the town or region. Uh, <laughs> okay. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. it's supposed to come up with a cover. Uh, so this one is my profile just now, which I uploaded. This one actually will come out. I think it's something. Uh, we will check it out whether it will come out. Okay. So so far so good. Anyone has already? Everyone has created a Facebook page. Okay, so today, uh, 
my main main focus is to really get into the first learning outcome. So we set up a Facebook page, and I feel that uh, I hope everybody enjoy the time. Really got into a Facebook page, and you got the notes that I pass it to you. You can actually go back, refinish it, make it nicer, change it, which I uh, or in another way you can actually make even multiple pages. Okay. Then uh, for the second uh, learning outcome, uh, because today is just a bit time constrained, uh, I couldn't actually go for the second one. Uh, so we will put it to the next lesson. Yeah. So the next lesson when you attend, you'll be able to really start off something and really market your business and make everything good and strong. Okay. Okay, stay there, everybody. Stay there. Stay there. Uh, since I'm creating a Facebook page and in, it is in this group, ma, I'm going to put <laughs> this <laughs> group as my profile. <laughs> okay, make it memorable. Yes. Okay, come. We take selfie, right? Selfie. Put your face into my. Oh. Yeah. Uh? Oh. Ready? I'll be happy, lah. Facebook, lah, huh? Facebook. Put Bruce Lee, can? Bruce Lee. Bruce Lee. <laughs> Make Bruce Lee very big. And then you went and spa with him. Yeah. I don't spa with him. Go. Go. Right away. Go. Right, okay. Now, <laughs> okay, Bagus. Yes. You'll see my Facebook page soon. Can I also take a photo? Because yes. it's my first. Course. Very good. Uh, I'm designing a thing and I'm impressed. So uh, I, I bought a camera because my, my food is there, so I think I will use a camera. Mm. Mm. Sorry, I cut into the I cut okay, into the feedback time. Mm. Okay. Okay. So let's everybody let's get it. Okay. So yeah, come. Too. So we take one and then for my memories, but I will just close it by the way. You got to sell a photo, huh? Okay, everybody, uh, action, action, action. Uh, like Bruce Lee, uh, like that. Uh, maybe nothing is difficult, uh, everything okay. can be resolved. Okay. Okay. Because strength to endure. Woo! Okay. Clear, huh? Clear? I need double check. I think uh, let me see so then, So do you know Facebook more? Yeah. 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 And thank you, Mr. Bruce Lee. Thank you. Okay, oh, you're looking at it. Is it right now? On the
Yeah, I'm ready. So, I plus. May I share my uh, self inspection to you guys? Start. Hi, good morning. I'm uh, Tetong over here. I'll be the assessor for today. And my cabinet will be uh, on thing. So, let me do a logistic checklist for now. This is the logistic checklist. So let's uh, go one round. So I got my own assessment plan right here. So here it's uh, in available here. And logistic checklist is right here. Okay, and the briefing coordinate checklist. So it's just right behind over here. Okay, and sets of assessment record, uh, which is uh, at the back, assessment summary records. And now I have to assess the assessment venue. So this is the assessment venue. So the room, I think it's all well in condition. It's all decorated. So it's good. Tables, right here, right here. For the mock-up store, it's here. Uh, we have our chairs for observers. Uh, for our, our oral session, is right here. Okay, and evacuation plan and uh, by extinguisher. Let's go and look it up. Yeah, just right outside. Okay, I saw a uh, fire extinguisher just right there. And the evacuation plan, here is the evacuation plan, uh, has been told. So uh, we assume that uh, evacuation plan, and I, we understand that in case of fire, we have to go out from this entrance or exit and then head down to the stairways. Okay. Alright, so uh, I'm done with the assessment venue. So now the assessment blocks. First and first, because we are doing a video uh, discussion, so there's a display shelf for mirror. Okay, good. A check and price tax. Okay, we got $30 here, $50, $30 for the scarf, $20 for the bling, and $80. Okay, price tags are all here. Scarves, let me count. We got 13 of scarf, 13 sets of scarves. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, so we got 13. How about ties? Let me calculate. Okay, so we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Okay, so current moment, uh, I got 24 uh, together with the pie over here, 25 in total, alright. Okay, so we got the tie ready, the shirts, we got three, three shirts for display, boxes, one, two, and three, the green color box. So it's three boxes, yeah, and uh, signage, our ABC store signage, A, B, C, shop. Okay, we got a signage and promotion tax. These are promotion tax, 30% off, and the ties as well. In here. Okay, and of course, basically, uh, I think I've done all the logistic, uh, log logistic check. So I'm, I'm done. I 
So uh, I'm Dito, the assessor for today. So basically the role play starts now. Okay, let's invite the uh, Ling today. Yeah, please come in. Hi. Hi, good morning. Good I believe morning. you are Hong Ting. Yes, I'm Hong Ping. Yeah, I heard a lot of from you, so you must be very I, I wish that you'd be competent for today. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, have a seat over here. Okay, so I'm basically the assessor today. I'm uh, Mr. Tay here. Okay, so uh, for the first part of it, uh, I, let, I, let, I will let you know that uh, basically this is an assessment place. I got an observer over here, so I hope that you can feel easy here first. I'll let you know what the situation. So uh, Rita right there is basically an observer for today. So uh, I'll be taking down notes and Rita will actually assess to be helping to assess the, the, the program here. Okay, and I'll be taking notes right over here. So at the start, not to worry, whatever you, I've written over here is only for the record of evidence. Okay, then all this evidence will be proved uh, whether you are competent or not competent. So not to worry, uh, just take it easy. Anything you feel uneasy, just let me know. Anything unsure, do not hesitate to let me know. All right, uh, can I have your IC? Did you bring your IC today? Yes. Okay. Okay, you just give me a while. I need to get your name written. So, can I uh, call you in short as an HP? Yes, please. Yeah, so. Have you been to this place before? Uh, yeah. And so, um, did you drive or did you take the MRT? Uh, I took the MRT. Yeah. Uh, it's easy to find. Uh, okay. Uh, this place is familiar to me. Why did you say so? Have you worked here before? Uh, have yeah, you come I... here for training before? Come here for shopping. Shopping as in uh, yeah, the Singapore Post, yeah, Paya Lebar Square, yeah. 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 Uh, come here and uh, meet up with friends who are working here. Mm -hmm. I see. Um, this place really has changed a lot. Uh, it's like a few years ago and a few years now. Uh, yeah, basically yeah. a lot changes. of new buildings coming up. So, uh, how you how long have you been in the company? Uh, less than a year. Less than a year. Mm. Uh, Up to about ten months, months. Yeah. About ten months into the job. See, ten months is uh, in fact uh, quite a uh, quite, quite, quite some some time. I I feel that uh, you might have some uh, quite the knowledge about the, the SOP of the company. Yes, yes. Are you telling me that nice secret? Yes. Yeah, so how's the training in the, the company? Is it on, on the job training? Uh, we attended the, uh, the courses yeah, at the PSG courses. Yeah. Mm -hmm. that, yeah. the PSG. Uh, I see. So company has sent you for training after, yes. after some on job yes. training. Yes. Yes. Uh, they decided to send you for training. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, I was uh, being uh, assigned for the assessor role to look into the performance because they have interest of employing you uh, further and even uh, having some uh, promotion plan. So I'll be doing the assessment uh, for that reason. Okay, so uh, for this particular uh, assessment is regarding uh, sell consumer goods or service. Uh, that's the module, uh, that's the course that you have been uh, going for. So currently, uh, you have been assessed for two modules. Uh, which is uh, to establish customer requirements, uh, recommend consumer goods and service. So in fact, the whole course itself is five modules, but currently you are only expected, uh, you are, at the current moment, we are only touching on two. So because of that issue, we are unable to provide the SOA for you. What is SOA? Uh, standard of attainment, very good uh, question that you have asked. Okay, so after the full session of the uh, five modules being fulfilled, you'll be uh, given a SOA, and I really hope that you can do it until then. Okay, so 
do you know uh, the setup for today? Uh, as in, uh, what you're going to be assessed? Mm. And what kind of things you're going to be assessed? Do you have any idea? You yeah, you have just mentioned about the two areas, which is the the customer's requirement and uh, the next one would be to recommend them the product and services of our company. Mm -hmm. yeah. I see. Okay, so uh, I, will, I will elaborate further. So uh, we'll touch on uh, establish a customer requirement, recommend consumer goods and service. Mm -hmm. And today we really set up a mock-up store over here just on our left. So this is the mock-up store that we will be doing and you'll be assessed as in, uh, in the salesman. Uh, I will, I will touch on your competency standard relating to uh, retail uh, industry. Okay. And the plots over here, uh, later on, you'll be given a few minutes to look into, uh, get yourself ready, and we'll actually uh, start off this role play. But before that, because uh, it's a new place over here for just for assessment purpose, we have to practice safety. So safety over here, in case of there's any fire that occurs, uh, there's a fire extinguisher just right outside this door. Uh, open the door on the left, it's clearly the fire extinguisher, very obvious. But of course, uh, if the, the fire is too big, we are not firefighters, we will head down straight away out from the entrance. Entrance and exit is basically the same. So we go there, we don't take uh, uh, we don't take the lead, we will take the service down for safety. How did you feel? Yeah. Are you clear with this? Uh, since we mentioned about safety, uh, is there any, in, you, you've been in the industry for about 10 months, really, uh, not to say whether you've acquired knowledge in the industry, but any legal things that uh, you have in mind that you can share with me so that I can understand that you are pretty competent regarding the legal rights? Uh, in terms of the SOP, uh, the company uh, stress on the and safety of the, uh, the safety act. Safety act. And, uh, yeah. Uh, Is it a workspace? Workspace. Yeah, we are workplace uh, hazards and safety act. So uh, we make sure that you know the the floor is clear. Uh, the customers don't trip on anything that's lying on the floor. Mm -hmm. okay. And we are also part of uh, the. Uh, Personal Data Protection Act where customers provide us with the uh, credit card or their personal information like their phone or email we, we are not to use it for other purposes other than for our company's uh, retail business mm -hmm. and the lemon law which uh, allows a refund policy uh, that you know, customers may uh, choose to uh, have a refund back start the assessment, I must let you know that the uh, role play is 20 minutes and then uh, uh, after so, you go for all the questioning about 10 minutes, mm -hmm. or in all about 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, I, are you aware of this? Yeah. Okay, good. And uh, before we want to start uh, the assessment, uh, do we have any special needs that uh, require my concern? Uh, no. Okay, fine. And uh, lastly, uh, this is something that I don't really wish to say uh, because whoever student, uh, whoever learners that comes in, I really hope that you get competent. In any case that uh, you are deemed as not yet competent, there's a few process. Okay, a few process, uh, there's charges for it, $30 uh, that is required from the HR department. It's not, uh, being, it's not decided by me. So you have seven days to make an appeal. Uh, they, after the appeal, they will actually assess my records of evidence. They will like me to talk to me, uh, maybe uh, get observers or uh, ideas, and of course, they will do assessment and uh, evaluation that comes by probably all the time. So, this is just a, a few process to let you know. Okay, are you clear with that? Yeah. Okay, finally, um, may I say that 
uh, you can be ready for assessment. Can take a look. Can take a look at this. Yes, yes. Uh, you mentioned that you've got a few minutes. You can just go there, uh, look into it, take your time for five minutes. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty fast. I think you are very confident. Okay, good enough. Alright, so role play gonna start very soon. So now it's uh, 10, now it's 10 40 a.m. So your role play will start in about 20 minutes. I wish you good luck for the role play. So if things are well, let's head on to the role play. Yes, please. Okay, so I'll give you a hint as in I'm going to come in and then uh, you as the sales man, uh, you do what you need to do. Sure. Okay, go play, start now. Now it's that 10.40, we take it 10.40. Alright. David, Daniel, okay, knock knock. Hi, good morning sir. Welcome to ABC shop. Right, uh, Feel free to take a look. Okay, um, good. Uh, what else are you selling over here? I, I just happen to be on the street, walking in, and I see some colors I, I thought of coming in. Checking sure, out. sure, sure, sure. Uh, we sell ties for gentlemen, uh, and we sell scarves for ladies. But of course, uh, ladies do wear ties, so we also have got lady customers coming in to buy ties for their friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, most of your customers, are they ladies or men? Well, we have a good mix of uh, uh, you know, genders. I see. Uh, today I may not have uh, the right mindset yet uh, to, to buy things. I'm actually going for like window shopping. I got one full day of free time. I actually walk around sure, sure, the shopping sure. center. It's a new it's, it's a new estate, a new shopping center, right? Yes, yes, yes. Feel free. If there's anything that uh, you need my advice, uh, I'll be most happy to assist you. Then yeah, let me browse through a bit first yes. so that I can uh, look into uh, this. Yeah, what may, may apply to my next occasion or maybe my my next. What's your favorite color tone, sir? Um, most of the things I'm wearing, wearing white color because I, I, I don't like to be uh, too dull in eyes, so I would really prefer something that's light in them. Uh, you give me a recommendation. I, I believe that uh, you might be more professional to give me ideas. Oh, sure. Uh, white color is the best uh, choice because uh, it can match with a lot of uh, color ties, whether you want it to be bright or you want it to be uh, professional. So over here, you can see that this range is the polyester type. It's uh, very affordable. Uh, currently, we have a promotion uh, during this uh, Christmas festive season at 30% off the regular price. So as it's now, it's $30 each and uh, you will get about a discount of $9. And that is uh, $21. So this mm -hmm. range here, will be very good for a uh, white color tie. You can try it on. And uh, the mirror is here. I see, I see. Yeah, take maybe, a look. Maybe hold on. Yeah. Uh, so, so you have only uh, one promotion for this. How about all this series? Right. So over here, these are a higher range ties that is made of silk and a hundred dollars each. And uh, at this moment, there's no discount because these are really quality products. Yeah. So uh, the other range here is a uh, cotton tie at fifty dollars each. Right. Again, these are very good quality ties, which uh, discount is not available. Mm hmm. Okay. So these are tie series. So mm. what? What? What's the reason behind is how come this one is so expensive? It's more than 
double the price of this, even triple the price of this one. Oh, definitely. So what, what, what's the difference between here? Oh, uh, the silk tie is actually uh, produced by our company factory in Thailand. We have a factory there that actually, you know, produce the uh, silk. Mm -hmm. And it's being woven. Oh, and you see that this one, also this tie itself is it's actually made of silk. Yes. No, is it normal that the tie is made of silk or is that the material? Of course, uh, the, the touch is very different. It's uh, really very uh, comfortable and it's very presentable for very important occasions that you know you want to dress well and be seen well. <laughs> Definitely, that, that, that's, that's yeah. what I wish for. I, I really yeah. wish that I can yeah. be the shy during a lunch yeah. or dinner. Yes, yes. And that's what I wish for. Yes, yes. With uh, your VIP customers, right? So that's why, yeah. Mm. So uh, I think that's I learned something. So, higher quality ties made of silk. And uh, these normal, are what kind of normal normal occasions. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. Over there, you mentioned yeah, polyester. What, 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 what polyester. Is, is polyester something? Uh, it is it a, a cloth. I heard a, that it's, it's a, more it's like a, a plastic. It's, or a, it's, a, it's a mix. It's a mix of uh, man-made uh, material. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. You know, there's a, there's a lot of man-made. Uh, yes, correct, correct. Uh, materials that comes by, but but yet it's still. Yeah, uh, it still serves uh, the purpose of maybe. yeah. It still serves a good purpose of a good uh, presentation. Yeah. So these are Thai range and these are only fifty cotton. So polyester, cotton and silk. Yes. This yes. is this is how we actually look into yes. when we are selecting our tie. Yes. Yes. Okay, Thai, uh, uh, I will check it out on the Thai later on. Uh, let me look at the scarf, maybe. Yeah, scarves uh, will also be uh, suitable for um, men or women. If you are traveling to a colder place, it will keep you warm. Right. Uh, okay, okay. So I this... never buy a scarf yet. Um, Bling bling, uh, this one. Uh, it's red color. Are you looking to buy for your wife or for your girlfriend? Oh, you are so observant. Yep, yeah, I'm. I'm actually, yeah, looking at something for my wife. Oh, yeah, okay. we are actually going for maybe uh, we are thought of looking at scarf, uh, thinking to travel around, uh, maybe at some yeah we, we we happen to take the hobby of traveling around, so we are looking at scarves that may maybe can help us in windy yes, times right. and then maybe sure. at cold areas. Uh, this color is bright. Uh, it's very bright. Yes, it's for some of the uh, ladies who likes to shine. Uh, generally, there are two groups of uh, scarves in terms of color. Those mm -hmm. that are bright and those that are, uh, you know, single color tone, uh, normal like this, will be good, right? So if you need something that is less bright, this will be a good choice. And with different color tones like this. This is mm -hmm. plain, right? Uh -huh. So just now I was saying bright and plain. And this is the in-betweens where you have a mix of colors. Mm -hmm. So that gives some of them, the, uh, you know, a, a middle range option of neither plain nor too bright. Um, but what kind of occasions are used for my wife? Uh, for dinner. Right. Uh, fine, fine, this, like fine, fine dining. No, no, no. It's uh, usually depending on uh, where you are, right? So if you are in a air conditioned room, you will keep the person warm, right? And uh, of course, uh, if you want to decorate yourself with more color, you 
because some people they have very plain color uh, coding. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this will add some colors to their overall look. Okay. It will be also nice if you have got you know a pen those uh, sand color. Yeah. Right. Okay, yeah. yeah. We, we, we did go for conference, that yeah. means a time yeah. to learn for more yeah. things. Yeah. 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 Because we you know we got more time uh, mm -hmm. rather to go out for yeah. more relation rather than just work and work in our life. There are there are there are promotions for this range. For this right. two range you will be a 30% off and there will be no discount again for our set range. Mm -hmm. I see. Uh, I think this one is only $20. It, 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 is it, a, it sounds like a bit cheap to, to, to give my wife uh, as a gift because now it's like Christmas. Oh, definitely. I mean, if it's really uh, intended to be a gift for someone, I would recommend that you get a set. Uh, range that will be, you know, show your sincerity. <laughs> oh, you're saying that. Okay. Uh, uh, it's a value for money. I I I do understand the yeah. point. Yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, because uh, yeah. I wish to give uh, whatever good things to my wife. Yes. Definitely, I will, I will, I will do. Okay, so this is a silk range, but eighty dollars, you know, uh, out there, I think probably it might not cost eighty dollars, right? Uh, well, of course, definitely they are very competitive. Uh. This uh, silk range of uh, scarves, there are many types of uh, quality that you need to be aware of. Uh, for our company, we actually guarantee you the value for money. Right. And yeah, we have a money back guarantee. If you find that you can get the same quality uh, silk with a cheaper mm -hmm. price, we are more willing to give you a full refund. Oh, full refund? Yes. Oh, that's we are very confident. Oh, that's a very good, uh, I would say, it's a very uh, high assurance of your company. Yes, definitely. We are very confident. I saw that there's some of. Um, so, so, all these are all. How, how come you can actually go for this kind of uh, high assurance? Is uh, because of some reason? Yes, because, uh, like I mentioned, the sale is uh, produced by our own company, Factory. Thailand. So we actually has got a very strong QC to ensure that you know whatever comes up from our factory are mm -hmm. high quality product. Yeah, because uh, that's that's something that uh, yeah we always uh, customer wish for. Yes, quality, good stuff, yes. value for money. Yes. but I still feel that eighty dollars is too expensive. Any any discount for this one? Um, if you have if you decide to buy five pieces. I will give my HQ a call. Five. Yes. Five. For, for which which item? For this silk scarf. For the silk scarf. Yes. That's so five times this is gonna be four hundred dollars for for my five. Well, we have a customers who come and buy ten uh -huh. at one go. You well, know because they are our regular customers. They know we have give them quality. So mm -hmm. we give them discount. So I will call up my HQ and I try my best to give you a discount. With the appearance of my HQ supervisor. I see. So so that's your uh, a bit of authority from your from your Yes, yes, this is actually. our company uh, operating procedures. Anything beyond my power I have to call back to the office. I see. So you guys can give a bit more discount. Yes, so our, our, our yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. So so I uh, I okay, fine. Uh, as long as uh, we can uh, get a uh, Sure. Uh, uh, further discount, why yes, not? Yes, yes. Right. I think that's for my wife. Uh, silk, silk, silk. This color. Uh, not to worry, I'll give you a new set. These are display yeah. over here, uh, which we let our uh, customers have a touch and feel. Right. So we will give you a new set from our store. On what color you want? Yeah. 
Okay. So if I buy, really want to buy this, uh, you're mm. going to give me a new set. Yes. I, I don't want all this. Uh, definitely, definitely, definitely. There's so many people who want it. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. This is a nice box. Can I, can I have the box as well? Sure, yeah, sure. We, 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 will, we will pack uh, a box for you. Uh, so box is inclusive in whatever purchase here? Uh, it is inclusive. Inclusive. Uh, just the scarf, or can I buy? Maybe I buy the tie and you give me this bigger box. Is it possible? Uh, no, the box actually goes with the scarf. Each box goes with a scarf. Yeah. Okay. So I cannot give you a tie, but take a box from the scarf. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. I, I'm not so unreasonable as well, uh, yeah. uh, But <laughs> do do you have a gift box for for yeah, for tie? You can see if you buy the. Uh, Cotton tie range, you will comes with a box, uh, not for the polyester, right? Cotton and silk tie, we will give you a box. Mm -hmm. Only for cotton and uh, silk, silk tie. Yes. So yes. those, if I if I buy two of them, it, it works up the price of this mm -hmm. one fifty dollars. No, we we can don't you, go this way. Can you help me to check because you can give me discount? Why not just a box? Can you can you maybe? Well, like I said, this. Each silk tie comes with a box, mm -hmm. you know, so it is being accounted for in, in our system. Okay. So I cannot be taking mm -hmm. the box from there. Then oh, the next okay. customer comes and buy a silk tie, I will be oh, run out of box. Okay. Okay. I think yeah, I, I hope you can, uh, yeah, understand. Look, I think I understand your point. It's like a one of the gift box, it's uh, comes with a tie, yes, with, uh, correct, uh, it's accounted for. So it's a one to one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, having most of the time uh, white shirts so uh, I would recommend a plain color tie that goes very well plain color maybe yes. what's the recommendation you can give me? Uh, how about this? it looks nice you can try here this one? on a mirror? yes uh, let me see first <coughs> okay uh, but I feel that this one is a bit uh, dull, any colorful, maybe slightly. I, I will not go for the extreme, but maybe uh, slightly brighter. How about this? This is this one. the slim tie that is slim tie. most uh, fashionable now. Oh, indeed, I, I saw quite a Maybe some youngsters actually wearing yes, very slim tie, yes, especially right. like a Korean, Korean pop star, right? Yes. Uh, a good recommendation. At least I can try something different. Mm -hmm. uh, um, this one. Would you like I to can, get you this? You got other colors for this one? Yes, yes, we do have. Okay, so have. can you get a blue, uh, a bit more bluish color for this, this, sure, this kind sure. of tie? Uh, sure, so you confirm a blue one? Yeah. Okay, I'll get it from my stock. Okay, and uh, I haven't settled my wife's thing. Uh, so, which is your best recommendation? Uh, it's really your your choice, you know, sir. I, 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 yeah, I you know decide. best. You know best for your wife's I, um, choice. We are not. She's not really particular in color. But uh, of course, so we don't. The want safest. To... The safest. Mm, okay, you give me your be a plain color, right? Mm -hmm. Plain color scarves. Which one is it? This is plain blue. Navy blue, we have got uh, yellow, we have got green. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think I'm getting a blue tie. Okay, I think I just go for a blue color scarf as well. I will go for silk because I really um, want to get ourselves enjoy and uh, be comfort. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you okay? You can help me to pack this thing up. Okay, so uh, thanks uh, for your one, recommendation. One tie and one scarf. Yeah, yeah, I, I can't really buy five. Okay, but, but, sure. Uh, you give me a packet nicely. Yes, yes, uh, I'll I do really that. Hope that uh, you can give help me. Give me a minute. That. I'll go to the store and pack your goods for you.
okay here you go sir all right thank you uh would how would you like to pay oh yeah almost i almost forgot about that yeah i will just pay by credit card okay sure okay so as okay we i just pay for it okay thank you sir have a good day right yeah. do come again thank you thank you all right uh end of role play okay end of role play uh, let me put this screen back Okay, and now it's the uh, it's the start of the order taking, almost getting to the start. Okay, can you give me a while. Let me just write down the time. So it's about uh, now it's about fifty. We say fifty fifty five, huh? Uh, so it's a bit overrun, uh, but anyway, it's fine. It's still within our policy of uh, trying to get you competent. So. Alright, uh, just give me a few seconds, look through, then we'll hit within the order taking. Okay, fine. I think uh, most of the thing actually works pretty well. Okay, so now it's the order. Uh, let's start off now. It's ten fifty-five. We just need ten fifty. All right. Uh, I'm gonna ask you a question. You try your best to answer it. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Thanks for your question. Uh, all right. Uh, let me ask you one question. Why is it important to serve free feedback around the customer? Um, this is a part of our company's SOP for a start. Uh, but generally. Uh, Greeting customers is a courtesy. Uh, when they leave, you also need to greet. That will make customers feel welcome and they will give our company a better, uh, you know, we give the customers a confidence and uh, assurance that, you know, we want to serve. Okay, you mean confident? Confident, let the customers feel confident that we are. Here to serve. Uh, okay. Uh, what 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 if you don't greet customer? Uh, you will you will you what will actually turn out to be? So I mean same thing when we we ourselves go shopping. If the customers uh, don't greet us, we feel that we are being slighted and uh, they are not interested in our uh, business. Uh, okay. Uh, so I we do not want the customer to feel this way that. Yeah, being slighted and uh, not welcome. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's. Uh, I. I'm actually trying to look into the respect. Yeah. I think uh, more or less is about that. Yeah. You. Uh, it's a way of respecting the customer. They feel yeah. they come in. They feel uh, yeah. positive. Uh, environment. Okay. Uh, another question. Another question. How do you find out what a customer needs? Uh. We would. Ask them some. Uh, other questions as to uh, are they looking for uh, ties or scar? Mm -hmm. right, then they will tell us okay they are, what is their choice and we will start to ask them further by you know, whether they are buying it for themselves or for their friends. Mm -hmm. So good. Uh, another question: When a customer objects to the price of an item, claiming that other stores are selling cheaper, uh, what would you actually say? Um, I will assure them that they will get value for their money, and they will be happy customers when they buy from our shop. Um, anything further to that? Uh, quality is very important that goes with the price. So they probably will compromise on the quality if they are getting a lower price item. So you keep on uh, emphasizing on quality? Yes. 
So that's all we have now. Okay. So other than uh, if the person still insists of uh, getting a cheaper price for me, what 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 are you going to do? And a very persistent uh, customer. You try to upsell by asking them to buy more, and uh, we will get the clearance from the HQ because this is not our SOP. So what's upsell? Like for example, if you buy five pieces, we can give you a discount, a further discount. Uh, if the person uh, still say that it's uh, it's it's too expensive, even after the discount, because maybe your things is really expensive. Mm. So so what what are you gonna do? Um, because we have our SOP and our cost to mm-hmm. manage, okay. so we cannot be selling at a loss. I see. So we you are rejecting the, the not to. Uh, not to like say rejecting, we probably will ask them to get an alternative uh, range that may be lower. Mm-hmm. Right, so that will fit into their budget. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay. I think uh, enough details for me. Okay. Uh, Two more questions. So the last two. How do you match customers' requirements to your product recommendation? Um, once we find out what is their choice in terms of the colors and in terms of their budget, we will refer them to our various range of a product that actually matches their color choice and their budget. Because we have got quite a wide range, so we are quite sure that we can find something for them. Okay, uh, excellent. Lastly, uh, name one reason why you may need to present alternative products to client uh, customers. Sorry, I always say client. Uh, my apologies. Uh, we always have to uh, understand that uh, customers comes with. Uh, Budget, and we we will find out from them, and from then on, with our wide range, uh, that will make the sales uh, more uh, easy to close the sales. Yeah, by providing the alternatives, our objective is to close the sales. Mm-hmm. I see. Yeah, uh, I think uh, budget is one of the issues. Right. Okay, uh, almost getting there. Okay, this one was uh, okay. I'm not sure about Okay, so I, as you see, gone through almost everything. Uh, let me uh, ask you uh, some questions. So, I'm actually looking at the, the image of the EDC, the English Need to Do Assessment. So, I feel that your, your, your shirt today is without a tie. So, maybe can you give me your reason why you're not wearing a tie today? Is it an SOP of the company? Oh, yes, it is an SOP of the company that uh, we actually are a walking mannequin. Are you, are you sure with that? That's the uh, SOP? Uh, because uh, we actually can bring the tie and then make on our shirt to let the customer have a feel of how it looks. So, yes. Um, based on my understanding, I, I, I would appreciate that uh, it can be a tie. Do you, really, do you think that it might be a, a better choice to get a tie on? Uh, because I didn't actually get to see uh, the tie onto yourself. Uh, that's upon the uh, customer's request, yeah. We will, okay. we will, okay. so we will uh, show uh, it on our... For the current moment, I'll put it as a, this is as SOP or a company. Yes. So anyway, uh, I'll be check out my yeah. course. Yes, please, uh, 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 yeah, please feed back to the company. Okay, so uh, I will double confirm, but anyway, I'll just put it as a uh, uh, SOP. 
Okay, so I have gone through the role play, uh, gone through uh, the oral taking. Okay, so everything seems seems well. Okay, I will give you my feedback uh, regarding uh, your your performance today. Uh, I have to look into the performance uh, criteria statement uh, to deem you as a uh, competent or not. So I'll give you my feedback. Uh, for the role play, when I look into it, I, I can see your strength. The strength is basically quite knowledgeable and you are very responsive. Uh, whenever I've got any question, query, uh, I can see that uh, your composure is there. But even so improve, I feel that you may require to be uh, more fueling. Uh, yeah, the, the way you speak, uh, perhaps uh, can actually become a very smooth method. Okay, so how to improve? Perhaps uh, you should have more practice, talk to client more. Yeah, I think you're gonna work out very soon, and uh, just I, I believe in you. Yeah, you can make it. Yeah, try to get into more uh, small talks, uh, then uh, you can get to a better relationship with the customer. If they are coming back, uh, or as a return customer, that will be uh, beneficial. It will be beneficial. So, yeah, I also feel that uh, you are quite resourceful. Uh, uh, it may be uh, on a slow manner, but very mindful. Yeah, you need to be fluent and, uh, like I say, uh, Conversation on uh, and improve yourself. Uh. Okay. Good. Okay, fairly well, everything. Yeah. So um, this is my feedback. You just let me write down uh, your, your your things over here. Okay. So um, I emphasize again your strengths is basically uh, resourceful. Knowledgeable, resourceful, and mindful. Um, weakness, I areas or improvement, just basically just uh, try to be more fluent. And lastly, uh, just talk to client more, uh, yeah, customer more, and it will be there. Uh, today, when I look into it, I will congratulate you that I'll put you as competent. Thank you. Okay, but you give me some time to write down uh, all the necessary. These procedures that I need to record down. Practice more fabulous. Okay, competent here. Competent, competent, competent. Uh, in the two areas, um, I would say that you are in track and company will be happy for your progress and this one so uh, this is the thing I will deem you as a competent and uh, do you agree with the competency that I give you yes thank you very much okay then we will not uh, go for the appeal process or anything that is uh, not that positive okay so competent so i will put down my name you have to sign over here so this is my signature which is uh, 18 december okay i'll get a pen over here uh, just uh, write down and give me your signature Okay. Um, 
we are not yet done. But anyway, congratulations. Uh, before that, can you give me your feedback? Yeah. assessment uh, checklist, uh, logistic checklist. So first, uh, over here, I'm, I'm going to do it uh, one by one. So assessment plan, uh, here's my assessment plan. Okay, uh, assessment plan check. Logistic checklist, this is the one. Briefing cabinet uh, checklist, this uh, the checklist. Together with a set of uh, assessment records, this book, okay? we've got a summary, assessment, assessment summary, candidates uh, feedback, and as well as the uh, end of assessment feedback uh, checklist. Okay, we go here. Alright, uh, let's check on the assessment venue. So, this is the, the room that we are using. We have our tables, we have our tables set up for the flops together. Is the one that we're going to do our uh, oral uh, questioning. Then chairs, these are the two chairs. And let's check on the fire uh, evacuation plan and the fire extinguisher. So we are being brief on the evacuation plan. Uh, we just need to head out uh, to the entrance. Entrance, uh, there will be. Uh, we need to head down to the stairways uh, for evacuation. And there's a fire extinguisher here. Fire extinguisher here. Okay, let's go back. Okay, now we will do a check on the assessment plots. All right. Uh, first thing first, we got our uh, display shelf. Uh, with mirror, this is the mirror, our price tag, yeah, here, $30.150, yeah, we have it all set to the right position, then scarf, these are scarves, let's check it out, how many we have, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, so 13 scarf, ties, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So we got 24 ties for this move crop. Uh, shirt, 1, 2, 3, 3 shirts. Uh, boxes, gift boxes for display. 1, 2, 3, and 4. Okay, we have it there. Oh. And signage, ABC shop signage. And finally, our promotion tax 30% off, Christmas promotion. And I don't know what for the scarf, 30% off. Yeah, so I'm done with my logistic check and we are all set. I'm, I'm, set, I'm all set, ready for the system. Thank you. 
Amen. Hi. Hello. Oh, no. Good evening. Good evening, sir. So you must be Olympic. Yes. Yeah, I'm Mr. Day here. And I'm Mr. Day. Tonight. All right, all right. Yeah, please have a seat. Thank you. Uh, have you prepared your NRIC for my verification? Oh, yes. Uh, with any uh, note stating, uh, I will be doing certain protocols. I will be writing uh, notes uh, for evidence. So don't mind me later on. I'm going to write the board. And today I got an observer today uh, joining in uh, for the assessment. So later right there will be a bit of observer. Okay. I hope you don't mind this time. Yeah, please. Okay. You give me a moment to write down your name. And now uh, we're racing for right of purpose. So have you taken your dinner? Yes, I have. Mm. Is it easy to find the place? Um, kind of, uh, but it takes me a while, but it is okay. Is it your first time uh, coming to this event? Yes, yes. seems to look upon you a lot. Uh, they have sent you to uh, training and that's why you are here today for assessment. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do you know that uh, what are the things you want to be assessed today? Uh, yeah. Uh, how to find out from the customers uh, what the what the their requirement is and after that match their requirements to our company's product. Mm -hmm. Okay, so in general, uh, you are actually having a com company actually send you for a course uh, to sell consumer goods and service. Mm -hmm. So you will be assessed uh, for two items, mm -hmm. which is also the two modules. One is to establish customer's requirement, mm -hmm. and the other one is to recommend uh, 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 goods and services. Mm -hmm. Alright, so today uh, we will actually assess on these two elements uh, based on industrial standard of retail. So, so far so good. Am I clear with my words? Mm, yeah, only the industry standard of... Uh, it's the, competen uh, the competency uh, level that I'm going to assess you today. It's based on the standard uh, for retail industry. So, uh, ties and stuff is basically under fashion. And uh, we actually operate retail shops. That's why it's in the retail industry. Okay. okay. So, are you clear so far? Okay, so anytime uh, if you feel there's any doubts, you can just call me. Sure. Okay, so today you'll be assessed on uh, two methods role play 20 minutes, mm -hmm. oral questioning 10 minutes, right. and total 30 minutes. Yeah, yeah. there will be uh, maybe there will be a plus minus or maybe a few minutes, but I'll try to keep it in the time. Yeah. Okay, so um, on my back, to my left, basically this is the mock, uh, mock up area that we actually did and try to make it as close as actual uh, condition. Mm. So the ties and the props, basically the out props is the ties that you've seen in your uh, video shop yeah. together with the scarf. So all these things it turns out for you mm. to use so assess your competency. Okay, uh, over here uh, is assessment uh, uh, place. Uh, we still need to practice safety, mm -hmm. so I need to give you, uh, highlight you the procedure of safety. Mm -hmm. Right, in case of uh, any emergency, uh, whether it's at a, a fire or the alarm actually sound out, uh, so uh, just outside this door on the right side, basically there's a fire extinguisher. Mm -hmm. uh, in terms of emergency and fire to use, we actually use that mm -hmm. for the purpose. Uh, in any case that we require to evacuate this place, we just head towards the 
entrance, which is also the exit. Uh, just out from the door on the left side is the stairways. We just hit down, just hit down by the stairways. Please uh, don't take the lift, and I'll be with you all the way. Yeah. Okay. All right. Since we mentioned about safety, we mentioned about the uh, work, workplace. Uh, is there any thoughts that you, you can come by regarding uh, legal uh, matters uh, within uh, your workspace? Uh, yes, uh, we, we have to be careful about the customer safety when they are in the shop. So it's a workplace uh, safety uh, requirement. Customers' uh, information in the course of uh, the purchases that they make, uh, they will provide us with their credit card information, their own particulars, or even their handphone numbers mm -hmm. uh, to join the companies. Uh, yeah, so we, we, we need to use it for its intended purpose only, so we should not be using it for other use. So that is uh, basically the personal data protection act that we need to observe. Mm -hmm. And uh, also the lemon law that uh, allows the customer to do a exchange or return if they find that the product does not meet the yeah, requirements. Mm -hmm. right. So these are the three that we need to observe. Okay, okay. Yeah, these are the basics uh, that uh, uh, we are need to understand about any legal rights uh, regarding between industrial. Uh, since just now you mentioned about the personal data, so whatever documents that I want to take down today, those your performance, uh, all these things will be confidential. I I I will be upfront to you that uh, your information regarding the assessment will only be passed to the HR department for evaluation purposes. Sure. Okay. Yeah. We can. Okay. All right. Uh, I need to explain about the uh, appeal process but I'm not actually looking into that case for the moment but it's just, uh, just a procedure so I'll explain to you about the appeal process uh, basically in any case that it turns out to be a NYC which is uh, not incompetent uh, you have to write actually to write in or send an email to the HR department within 7 days and pay a fee of $30 and they will actually assess your, your application and if you require it within four weeks. Yeah. Okay. So so far so good. Are you going? Yeah. Now before I wanna start the role play, uh, the, the real assessment, do you have any special needs that uh, you might my concern? Uh, no, not really. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I believe that you are fit to go. Yes. For assessment. All right. Uh, you can take a few minutes uh, to look at the mock store over here. Mm. Then once you are ready, you can uh, just uh, call me again. Mm. I will also ask you for confirmation before we start. All right. Yeah, please take your time there. Sorry. 
I, I just happen to pass my I got no idea as a must for one inside. Okay, uh, we are selling ties and scarves. Sky, sorry again? The ties and yeah. scarf. Gentlemen ties and ladies scarf. Of course, uh, it is not just that. Yeah. You can have uh, ladies not wearing ties. Sorry, you mean? Sorry, so ladies mean? do wear ties nowadays. So are the ties uh, towards it's ladies or yeah. is more appropriate it's for, for me? Both. For both. Yes. Uh, maybe uh, which are the one that I am I'm just out of curiosity, which are the one that it's for the ladies? No, both. This one for the lady? Can also. Is it appropriate? Yeah. <laughs> it sounds a bit weird. <laughs> It's individual switch. Okay, okay. Yeah, down fashion really comes clear. Eh? Uh, what's so special about your, your ties and your scarf? Um, I'm not sure because I. Uh, New in the company. Uh, How long have you been in the company? Uh, just two months only. Uh, months. And is there any like a basic understanding? As in, at, at least I, I need to know I'll, what I'm going to buy. Uh, I'll try to answer your question as, uh, as much as I know. You got any offer going on because Christmas is coming by? Uh, offer as shown here in in the label, we have thirty percent. Thirty percent for all items? Uh, no, it's only for this regular price item. It's not for silk and for cotton. Uh, so it means that uh, okay, now I see. So there's three types of yes. ties. Yes, three quality, three material. Uh, what is material? Polyester, silk, and cotton. Mm -hmm. What's why 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 is there's a big range of uh, difference in the price? Uh, I'm not sure. If this is what the HQ provide us with this information. issue information but normally do you wear ties uh i don't wear ties i can see that you're not wearing a tie uh, uh or you wear scarf i don't wear scarf uh, all right uh, so any recommendation what should i wear um, recommendation uh, what would you prefer your color? Mm, I'm wearing white color now. Perhaps uh, maybe you suggest a color for me. Uh, white. Any colors will go with white. Any colors? Yeah, white is the most neutral color. But does some of the colors the pattern fits for fits for all ages? Um, that I'm not very sure. It's individual person's choice. Poly mm -hmm. Esther seems like a plastic name to me. I'm not sure. Okay. Let me see. The 
this silk. Down here is put as cotton, but it should be cotton. It feels the same. Uh, uh, have you misplaced it some? Can you confirm I'm whether not, this is a cotton or a, or a silk? I'm not very sure. But if you buy before, you should you you should know it. Eh? Yeah, I'm a customer. I may not know as much as you know. Yeah. I also don't know. I joined the company two months. Two only. months. Uh, two months you've been looking at the uh, price dealing. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, okay, okay, alright then. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll just take it. Uh, why not we go to yeah. the scarf and yeah. Yeah, maybe you, you may not know much about Thai or about the uh, scarf? I equally don't know eh, because I'm here only two months only so not very sure about the products mm -hmm. but I'll try to answer your question as as much as I know Mm -hmm. Okay, so um, how about that you give me an understanding about the silk? The silk is uh, our company's product. Uh, we produce our own silk in Thailand and uh, it is of good quality. So it's from Thailand? Yes. And the ABC brand is... Uh, it yes. is uh, we, it's a local brand. It's a local also. brand. My boss owns the factory in Chiang Mai. Oh, Chiang Mai. Yes. So you produce all the scarf yourself? Yes. Uh, I mean from the company? Yes. Popular Thai? Most popular Thai? Uh? <laughs> I, I'm, not, I'm not sure because I don't have a sales record. i also very new here. Um, Usually, but, but, but how many Thais have you sell have you, have you no, for these two months? Uh, very, very little. Okay, so so which are the best seller you saw you, you saw off so far? So far I sell this this one two only. Mm -hmm. Okay, so um, I think this is perhaps your best recommendation. Um, I'm not sure because customer tools are not I not I they like the high pattern they will choose. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I see. So I, I'll just help myself, huh? Okay. Can I help myself? Okay. So your company practice uh, self-service? Uh not true. Uh. Not true. Not true. I will try to assist you as much as I can. You like which color I will take for you. You like which feel you can try out. 
then I will check from the store whether it's available stock. Okay. Uh, he looks like a nice guy, but uh, weird thing as in uh, you, you are not quite sure about what, what kind of ties uh, you are actually selling. Uh, I am I'm now equally puzzled now. <laughs> uh, I'm not very sure, so the company also never do anything about it. They asked me to sell, I sell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see, I see. Black color. This scarf is mostly used at uh, what kind of occasion? Mm. Depends on, uh, sometimes the they buy and give it to their friend, they also don't know when they want to use it but can be just hang on their neck to make themselves nice only So you, uh, am I in interpreting it as in it can be wear at all occasion? <coughs> uh, it should be it, uh, Sorry, it, one, should, be, it should be, it should be uh, because yeah, most of these people the uh, environment is all air conditioned. But uh, if you are walking, uh, maybe on the street, there's no yeah, aircon. Yeah, once they uh, feel hot, they will go and look for aircon room. Uh. So your, your, your house must be your home, the aircon is always on. Uh, no, they can go to shopping center. Yeah, just like right now, the aircon is uh, it, it, it is pretty cold over here. Yes. Yeah. <coughs> it's me. Hi, hi, yeah. Uh. So this is uh, also made from Thailand? Yes. But you mentioned like uh, Dunhill and some of the weird branded, seems like a, this one is, is it like a Dunhill brand? Yes, yes. So you could, in fact Dunhill is produced, uh, the ties are produced in Thailand? They take the product from us. They take the final product from us and they print the logo. Because of the quality that we produce, mm -hmm. right? So you find that a lot of all the branded products, branded, uh, you know, all these good, expensive brands, they actually take the material from us. Mm -hmm. They don't have the factory of their own. Mm -hmm. Okay. We produce according to their specs. So really no recommendation for me? Uh, yeah, you see what you like. Uh. Uh, at least uh, what kind of colour do I fit in? Uh, again, it's your choice. What, what colour you prefer, uh, your favourite colour. Yeah. We have all the various colour tones for you to choose. Um, wearing white colour? What, what, what? Maybe yeah. which other one? All these are here, you can choose. Maybe if you want, you can take this maroon color. Maroon, okay. Maroon okay. color, yeah. yeah. But maroon color looks a bit, looks a bit dull. No, you have to look from the mirror and put it on and see for yourself. You will see that it is 
the best matching color. But seriously, I don't like this color. <laughs> So this one hundred dollars. Is there any discount for, mm. for, for this type uh, collection? We are not giving discount for this range. Two hundred dollars. Christmas time, New Year is coming. Uh, uh, no discount at all. Sorry, we we were told to set at this price. I see from somewhere else they are selling even cheaper. Mm -hmm. Maybe probably even half the price. Uh, I cannot guarantee you the quality for them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so they they might have uh, some inferior quality, but if you are not, they are also made from Italia. Oh, also made from uh, Italy. Sure, I mean, but you you. you you will feel the difference when you 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 buy one and try yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Let me uh, look through a while. Uh, Discount? Any discount? Uh, no. Only the this range. Yeah, thirty percent off. For this and this only. As written here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I think Hongbei. Uh. I think perhaps uh, let's end this session. Uh, let's head uh, to the desk and then we go for the next session. <coughs> Greeting them, yes, and okay. So, you are saying uh, the image of the company uh, yes. by greeting and then to keep parallel. Well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the company's image will be enhanced. Mm -hmm. Okay, fine. So I'll, I'll take that as your answer. Second question, uh, how do you find out uh, what the customer needs? Do you need me to repeat your question again? 
Alright, uh, how do you find out what a customer needs? Not sure. Usually I ask, I will wait for them to reply. To ask me. Uh. To ask you. Mm. Mm. Is the whole day, day, uh, do you ask? Okay. What, 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 do they, what do they want? Okay, so you will ask them questions. Uh, uh, you will let them ask them questions. Yeah, they, yeah, they will yeah. tell me what they want. Okay, that's, that, that's, that's the best we can do. Mm. Okay. Question: When a customer objects to the price of an item, claiming that other stores are selling it cheaper, what would you say? Uh, we will tell them that the quality is the most uh, superior one, and uh, they will get the value for the money. Mm -hmm. yeah. Any any further uh, details for me? We will also both, uh, tell them that um, we are very confident of our quality mm -hmm. and get the value for the money. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, uh, value for money and quality, this is what I heard. Uh, so, nothing to add? And any further things to add? I can actually go through everything over here. Uh, let me give you a feedback yeah. uh, directly. <coughs> okay. Uh, I have gone through the role play together with uh, part of the oral question. Uh, my feedback to you is in fact uh, you are a very pleasant guy. Thank you. Uh, as a person. Uh, you have a you have the politeness, uh, but somehow uh, you seem a bit uh, not professional. And not so knowledgeable. Yeah, because I'm just uh, new in the company, and uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so these are a few things that uh, you need a lot of improvement, I believe. Uh, Okay. Um. okay. <clears throat> All right. Uh, let me just uh, look into and uh, yeah, uh, that's my feedback to you. Yeah, you have a uh, pleasant. Uh, you are a pleasant person. You have the politeness, uh, but not so professional. Uh, not so knowledgeable and improvement. Uh, one thing, I have a thing, serious thing to tell you. I feel that uh, you might not be competent at the moment. And based on assessment, I will make a decision that you are not yet competent. Why am not yet competent? I, actually, this one here is not yeah. Please, uh, don't, don't, <coughs> can you uh, give me chance or not? Don't put me as non competent because I just joined the company only, I need the job. And if you put me as not, com not yet competent, I will lose my job. Please, uh, don't give me a chance. Uh. 
Quand on a utilisé des semaines, on a fait certaines procédures à l'étude. La compagnie a été mise à l'assessor, je dois être en train de garder ce qu'ils ont besoin de leurs employés. Ils vous envoient pour le training, pour le purpose, pour que vous puissiez vraiment comprendre comment créer des opportunités, pour vraiment comprendre les besoins des clients et pour faire des recommandations. So, I but you can do something, right? You you write, don't write the actual thing, lah. Uh, but that's something that is not. Uh, uh, I need a job, you know. This this if you this lah, uh, help me. Uh. Yeah, I'm hoping. Uh, I understand your point. Uh, it's a society issue that you need a job, but really, uh, if I had make you competent today, you will not be good for you, you will not be good for the company. So, sad to say, I will still have to put you non-competent after so many recovery that I tried to do for you. In fact, uh, there's a lot of things that it's uh, not yet competent and I did recovery during the role play, during uh, while we are sitting here and even during the oral questioning. But it turns out that I can't even finish up the, the, the oral questioning. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so I have to say that I have to need, need to put you as a body competent and you have to re retake this assessment again. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so be prepared uh, okay. for the next assessment. Okay. So, are you agree with my decision? Okay, now what to do? You already just don't give me time. Um, I wish so, but I really hope that uh, you actually take okay. this chance okay. and learn from that. Okay, okay. Yeah, That's so, okay. alright. So, I'll put down my signature okay so you have a right to make an appeal mm. uh, uh, in, in in any case or M myc uh, mm. which is not competent is my mm. uh, duty to let you know about the the appeal process so as explained early uh, you can actually make an appeal in the next seven days mm. uh, to your hr department mm. they will give you an answer in four weeks time mm. and you need to pay for thirty dollars uh, mm -hmm. mm. Okay, so <coughs> you have agreed and uh, just let me write down this and hold on. Okay, so hoping uh, you agree to my decision. May you just help me to sign here? Your name, your signature and your time and the date, sorry. Okay, and I need to because I already explained to you about the NYC uh, situation. So mm. could you help me to uh, sign over here as well to acknowledge that I I have I have already given you an explanation about mm. the appeal process. Okay, uh, apologies for that kind of uh, situation that I don't wish to see, but I have my duty. Alright, uh, can you help me to do a feedback before we end this session? Okay.